now you see here i have taken the elements in the two dimensional array what is this two dimensional array this two dimensional array is a collection of one dimensional arrays how we are saying see this is a one dimensional array one comma two comma three is this is another one dimensional array is four comma five comma six so this finally we are representing with the two square braces we are ending with the two square braces it is giving the two dimensional array now i want to know what is the dimension so i am writing a dot n dimension so this a is the array now we want to know how many rows are there how many rows are there two rows because we are using two square brackets here the elements we are separating by comma how many elements we are separating this is one this is one so there are two rows i can write in this may in this manner in order to make you understand in the better way so here there are two rows this is first row this is second row and there are three columns okay so rows are two and columns are three and how many elements are there there are total six elements now we are executing this you can observe this is a two dimensional array there is no doubt and uh, how many we are giving we are we are giving the command a, a dot shape by using this command a dot shape we can get how many rows and how many columns are there in that array there are two rows and three columns if we give a dot size that will print that total number of elements how many elements are there total elements are six now this time we are writing seven comma eight comma nine so if i execute this one you observe this is the two dimensional array still but there are three rows and three columns and what are how many number of total elements are there total elements are nine this is how we can get the dimension of array by using a dot n dimension we can get the rows and columns of that array by using a dot shape and we can get the total elements of that array by using a dot size